Sydney said he was coming here to ride tonight, but um, Ryan Rawls got in the way at the very last minute, and then it's going to take his place on the terrace for the rest of the right hours to go. Yeah, it's got to be really frustrating, hasn't it? Frustrating for everybody, not just him. Also hitting him in the pocket at the end of the day. I mean, these uh, meetings are arranged. You'd think uh, if you're racing for Australia, the Australians will make sure that all the paperwork and everything is done for you. You shouldn't be chasing around to do it yourself. You know, it's uh, a team thing. It's a world thing. I mean, what a joke. Uh, Australia out there in the Ukraine, they probably haven't even got a team out there now or... Uh, Maybe half a team, who knows? But uh, from Tyson Nelson and Rye House point of view, it's a disastrous evening. Yeah, very much so, and uh, they're going to have to do it. They're going to have to do it the hard way. You've got a fancy, steady, fastly experienced rider. You know, he's been there son, and done it. But, um, you know, if you can get a win here, then the uh, Tigers with, of uh, course, Albini has looked uh, pretty useful himself. Uh, they could all be level after this one, and uh, you're looking at Heat 13 and 15. Uh, Stead and Wells are going to be out again. But uh, Casper really got the grip between his teeth there, kept on going, and uh, all of a sudden, the uh, Rockets are looking in a good position in this heat. Well, Pete, that was the ride of the night, wasn't it? Superb stuff. And uh, this youngster, he doesn't uh, know the names, obviously, because he don't care who he's against and what the conditions are. He will always give 100%, and that was a well-deserved win.